Welcome to another episode of What's New in Cabinet Vision version 8. In this video, we're going to be going over the new features in the drawing section of Cabinet Vision. The first thing we need to do is be in a job, so I'm going to fast forward here to a simple job with a single cabinet. Now, since we are working with the drawing section of Cabinet Vision, we now need to click on the Drawings tab. The first new feature that I want to go over has to do with printing, so let's click the Print button to bring up the print dialog. Now I know we don't have anything in the drawings, but luckily we don't need anything to see this feature. The first thing you should notice is that the print dialog has a newer updated look to it. This isn't really the new feature and it really doesn't give you much that the old dialog didn't give you. The new feature is actually the current page option. This gives you the ability to print on the current drawing page that you are looking at instead of having to print all of them. The next feature is in the Drawing Properties, so let's right-click on the Workspace and select Properties. You should notice the new Title Block tab. Let's click on it to take a look at it. What this Property tab allows us to do is to define the title block that we want to use on the current drawing page. Once we select a title block, we can also click the Set as System Defaults button and any new drawing pages we create will have that title block on it. I would like to note that when you select a title block, it will be added to a new layer on the drawing sheet. If you set the title block to none, the title block and the layer will be removed. If you select a different title block, the current one will just be replaced. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video on the new features of Cabinet Vision. We hope you enjoyed it, and as always, if you want more information on Cabinet Vision Solid, please visit our website at www.cabinetvision.com.